Now for well over 90 years, the ARRL Handbook for Radio Communications has been a tremendous resource and RF engineering reference uh, for not only radio amateurs, but really for anybody who's interested in electronics. Uh, there are chapters on test and measurement and troubleshooting, and of course a, a lot of information that's kind of geared primarily towards the radio amateur in terms of setting up stations and building equipment and things like that. But the book really starts off with a lot of uh, basics, uh, right from uh, Ohm's Law and passive components up through analog and digital electronic components and circuit design and things like that. So a tremendous resource. The handbook is updated every year as uh, technology and techniques uh, advance over the years. So it's a good idea to keep yourself current and pick up a new volume every couple of years. The handbook has long been offered in both the soft cover edition as well as hard bound editions. But for the 2019 edition, the 96th edition, the ARL has added a really interesting new option. The 96th edition is available in a very handy six volume boxed set. All 28 chapters of the main volume are just broken up into individual volumes that are kind of arranged by topic area. Now, of course, the great advantage to these individual volumes is now you can just pick up and read the uh, particular topics you're interested in without having to wield around that very large volume. Very handy if you want to take it uh, you know, on the train on your way into work or take it on vacation like I do. Um, really a nice way of enjoying all the content of the ARL handbook. So let's take a real brief look at the table of contents of each of the volumes. Volume 1 covers introduction and fundamental theory of what is amateur radio, electrical fundamentals including uh, passives and semiconductor devices, radio fundamentals, AC waveforms, AC circuits, resonance, those types of uh, uh, topics, and then circuits and components, practical considerations for uh, design with amplifiers, op amps, A to D conversion, etc. Right, volume 2 is the first part of practical design and principles, and it covers topics such as uh, basic RF techniques. Uh, computer-aided des uh, circuit design, uh, including simulation, power sources, AC, DC, uh, power supplies and such, digital signal processing and uh, software-defined radio or SDR fundamentals, as well as getting into oscillators and th synthesizers, analog and digital filtering techniques, and uh, modulation techniques. Volume 3 continues on the practical design and principles and talks about receiving and transmitting uh, uh, both circuits and architectures and how they work, transceiver design topics, digital protocols and modes that are very common in amateur radio and elsewhere, amateur radio data platforms, RF power amplifiers, and uh, radio repeaters. Volume 4 covers antenna systems and radio propagation including uh, the propagation mechanisms for, um, for uh, radio signals, transmission lines and their characteristics, and antenna basics and a bunch of uh, antenna descriptions and different antenna topics. Volume 5, which is Equipment Construction and Station Accessories, has chapters uh, on component and data references for resistors, capacitors, transformers, etc. Construction techniques, how to build circuits, uh, talking about surface mount technology and through-hole technology, uh, uh, PCB design, things like that, and assembling a station, how, how to put a station together efficiently. And the final volume uh, covers one of my favorite topics, test and measurement equipment, troubleshooting, RF, and the complete index. Uh, the table of contents here is test and measurement uh, equipment and measurements, uh, how to make AC, DC, RF measurements, and measurements on various uh, radio type devices, transmitters, and receivers. Troubleshooting and maintenance, uh, what equipment you might need, uh, some of the things that you, you ought to do to kind of maintain your equipment and th things like that. Also uh, a nice chapter on RF interference, how to detect it, manage it, and remediate. And then a chapter on safety. And of course, the uh, final index for the entire set. Well, this new six-volume box set of the ARL handbook is certainly going to add to my use and enjoyment of the handbook. It makes it a lot easier to pick up a particular book to sit down on the couch and take a read rather than to lug down that big heavy book that uh, I've been doing for many 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 years. Uh, there will be a link uh, down in the video description below with more information uh, about the uh, box set and where you can get your copy. I certainly appreciate uh, you watching the video. Give me a thumbs up if you like it and thanks again as always for watching.